Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. The kids and I just got back from a walk and I was about to make myself some avocado toast. Um, I started getting into avocado avocado toast again um, and I, now I want every day. So um, I will show you guys how I've been making it. It's so good. So we went for a little walk this morning. I've been trying to get out with the kids after we take Ella to school for a walk for like a half hour every morning because pretty soon here it's gonna be too cold to do that. So, and I feel like it's been really helping my mental health. I know the last video I posted, um, I wasn't doing so good. And I just feel like getting outside and like first thing in the morning has been really helping me. So yeah, trying to do that every day because I know pretty soon I'm not gonna be able to go outside and I'm pretty sure that I'm also maybe getting a little hint of seasonal depression. I get it every year that I've ever lived in Michigan, not when we lived in Nashville as bad, but it's really cold. It's not really cold, it's in the 50s, but it's cold and it's kind of getting to me, I think. So, and just seeing the leaves fall, like I love fall, but like knowing what's about to happen this year, winter, because we live in Nashville for two winters, I'm a little scared. But like, that's how I've been dressing myself up and not just like living in leggings and t-shirts. Um, I have Luca here. So, the house is a complete disaster. I don't know how because it was clean when we went to bed last night, but it is. And we're having Ella's birthday party in a couple days here. So Tommy is actually off. Um, I need to get a tripod, but Tommy is actually off today. So I'm gonna we're gonna go to my mom's and grab a couple tables because she has some tables for us to use for the party. We need to go to Costco and get some like party supplies and stuff like that because then he works um tomorrow and then the party is the next day and so i just kind of need his help like getting some things um because then tomorrow i'm gonna have to pick up some cookies get like just all the things i have to do so um and clean the house and everything <laughs> even though like i said even though when I clean the house, it gets trash within minutes. So Saturday morning, my mom's gonna come over early and help me like watch the kids so I can like make sure the house is super clean. But I need to clean the house today. I just we're gonna be we have a lot of errands to run. Um, so I thought I would take you guys along with us for today. We're gonna be out and about and also have a lot to do around the house. So first, we're gonna make the avocado toast. Eating some baby puffs. I love baby puffs. Right now, you guys, it is. It's trash. And I'm telling you, it was clean when we woke up this morning. This um, red pepper spread with eggplant and garlic from Trader Joe's is amazing. And then I also like to sprinkle feta on it. So I'm just using this Dave's killer bread. It has five grams of protein and fiber. And I like this bread a lot, so. Okay, so my dad has chickens and it's really cool now that we live close because I can just get fresh chick chickens, fresh, I cannot talk to you guys, fresh eggs. So these are from his chickens. We got there and we got to see the chickens and he just loves that being able to like do that with the girls and cool because when I was little my grandparents have ch had chickens and like those are some of the best memories I have are going to my grandparents house and like chasing the chickens around and everything and now they get to do it and it's super fun and I get fresh eggs so anyway I thought that was cool I would love to have chickens but I don't think we can in our neighborhood so it's cool that my dad has them and maybe one day he'll get like goats that would be a dream I don't know if I've talked about this I don't think I have actually, but Luca, I know I showed in a video that I gave him eggs, um, but he actually had a reaction about a week ago, like a really bad reaction. Um, sorry, Daisy's losing her mind, but he he had a, I mean, it was, I thought it was really bad. He didn't like stop breathing or anything. Okay, sorry, I got interrupted, but I'm just putting some avocado on my toast and then I'll, actually no, what I'm gonna do first is put this down and then avocado, but. While I'm doing this, I wanted to tell you that, yeah, so I got interrupted, but um, he, Luca had a reaction to eggs. He had a rash all over his face. It was really bad. 
he was kind of swollen and he had a rash pretty much all over his body and it was his second time having eggs so we're not giving him eggs anymore um he has a doctor's appointment with a new doctor in a couple weeks so i'm gonna bring it up and just kind of see what to do i've never had a child with any kind of allergy food allergy so i'm a little bit nervous because i just i don't know i feel bad like i i do something that we eat all the time and there ain't a lot of stuff I, i've been really since then i've been like traumatized and i'm kind of nervous to like feed him anything so we're kind of doing things slow and he's not like super interested in food like chunks of like food like pieces he really likes like when i like pureed food i feel like i always say that word weird but when i give him like pieces of food he just doesn't like it but he does like puffs i don't know so we're just going with it i was going to share like um maybe like a my baby's schedule and like what he eats in a day just life has been a little crazy and i've just not been doing the best mentally but i'm doing good today and i think that the walks are helping and everything so okay here's my toast my egg um then i'll put my egg on top or maybe next to it i'm not really sure but that is my breakfast i once felt i'm done with the defense throw back and climb over your fence hide to show show you that i was a mess so you were shrugging your shoulders i'm closed off that's what i told you soon enough Everything started to change Cause there's no going back, no going back There's no going back to your own life Not living in the past, we're over that I'm feeling it tonight, riding on the dizzying heights Hey guys, it is the next day now. I never finished vlogging yesterday because I forgot my camera and we were really busy. And so I was like, you know what? The next day is gonna be, yeah, next day is gonna be even busier. So I'll just take you guys along with us for this day. And it's the morning's already started off a little crazy. Tommy took um, my car keys and my purse with him, with my wallet and everything. So luckily we had a spare, but I had to go pick up my um bag from him because it had my card in it cards in it and everything <laughs> yep we're gonna go in a second so we finally made it to target we have so many errands to run today i have to go to target party city the market um it's a ton of things so there's a ton of places to go and things to get ready for the party so we can gonna take you along with us for our day we're heading into target right now i'm gonna grab some starbucks in here and a cake pot for lila because we really didn't i didn't have a coffee and i am like struggling you don't want a cake pop what do you okay no cake pops for lila then i don't know something for the kids but anyway let's go um into target cheers I need some shoes because it's cold. But I blacked out and I bought a ton of Halloween decor, mostly for our front porch because we went to the store yesterday and we got like hay and some pumpkins and I don't know, I just wanted to get more stuff for it. So the Halloween decor is so cute and I don't really like, we don't like scary things so we don't really decorate for Halloween like scary. Um, but they had a ton of cute things, like cute Halloween stuff, like cute little pumpkins. So I blacked out. Um, I don't even know what I went in there for, but I didn't get anything I needed like for the party. Um, they didn't really have anything, so we're just gonna go to Party City to get like tablecloths and all that. I'm really not going crazy with decorations and everything because I decorated on her actual birthday, and I don't know, it's just a kids party and like Instagram and stuff, like people go all out. And I am mean, getting like cute cookies and a cute cake, but 
it's just family and there's really no need for me to go super crazy i love those big beautiful parties uh, maybe one day we'll do something like that but i feel like i've been driving forever i had to go pick up the cookies um and that was the opposite way of where we were kind of and then i drove another different way to get to this market that i wanted to get some like dips from and both of the kids fell asleep so i will show you guys the cookies i'm so excited about these i don't even know how i'm gonna let people eat them because they're so cute stinking how stinking cute are these bluey she did her name on a bone paw print yeah i'm gonna show you they're so cute bingo okay hold on let me show you got bingo and um, happy birthday cake she's gonna freak out 12 45 and we're finally home um i still need to go to party city and i didn't go to kroger i wanted to go to kroger to get like chips and pop but i'm probably gonna just place an instacart order because shopping with a lot of with multiple kids or even just one kid when you're like on a mission i feel like it's kind of hard we spent a while in target which was nice i had not been in target in weeks and we kind of just had some fun in there and i will show you guys what i got from there in a minute and then like i said i had to drive over i was like driving around all around the state of michigan i feel like today i was just driving so much from having to get my wallet from tommy to going just all like literally so many different directions and so i decided that we'll go to party city um after we pick up Ella, that way she can be a part of like her birthday process. I originally wanted to go without her because it's just going to be a lot harder with all of them because it's like such a fun store. They're going to be so distracted, but we'll have more time after school and it'll be like a more fun thing. Plus Lila, we were hungry and I didn't want to go out to eat because we've been eating out a lot lately. So we're home now. I'm going to put all this away. I'll show you guys what I got from Target. I feed Luca at the store. They always give the kids fruit, which is like really fun. So um, I couldn't feed him while walking. So he's having some watermelon right here. And then, yeah, we have a couple hours where we have to go get Ella. So like I said, I probably won't get much done around the house. I probably won't do much of the cleaning until tonight. And then tomorrow my mom's going to come early to watch the kids while I clean. Um, it's just really hard to get anything done with them around. Um, but maybe I'll, I don't know what I'll be able to get done today, but... At least I did my errands and I'll probably place an Instacart order from Kroger just to get like a couple of things of chips and yeah I know I'm probably acting like this birthday party is like the biggest deal ever but like I've never thrown a party before and this is our new house like no one's ever really been here besides my brother and my parents and Tommy's parents so I just want the house to look nice and I want Okay now it's time for a Target haul. I don't know why I bought so much stuff but Luca is playing over here he's playing with a coke zero box so don't buy your kids toys because they would rather just play with a box basketball toys chooses the cardboard box but um okay so i've been dressing myself in like real clothes for the first time in like i don't know a long time so now i can't stop and i bought myself some more things um I just, yeah, I have not bought myself clothes because last year I was pregnant and then postpartum, I mean, I got some graphic t-shirts and stuff, but I'm just feeling really good dressing up myself every day and it's really not anything crazy, but it makes me feel better. So I found these cute little clogs. <laughs> I mean, I don't know. They're so something my mom wore in like the nineties, but I just thought they were really cute and I wanted them. So the shoes are buy one, get one half off right now. I don't know if they will be when you guys see this so i got those and i got um a pair of boots which i can show you guys too um then i saw this cute little denim dress and i honestly thought this with this would be really cute and i thought maybe i could wear it for her party tomorrow um i feel like you can wear the this like so many different ways you can wear it as a dress like a jacket um just really cute so I got that and then I got myself this pretty sweater because I feel like this is pretty basic and I don't really have like a cream sweater and that'll be really good going into fall, winter, and even spring. And then for the fall stuff, so this sign I thought was really cute. It was only 10 bucks. It says hello fall. Hey. Oh. Hey. Okay, you want to put a toy in your box in your little bin? You want to see the shoes that you got? 
Daisy, can you get out of the thing? Okay, he just hit himself with a little pop. I saw these cute little plates for the girls, so I got them each one for Halloween. Yeah, honey? Okay, go ahead. Oh, you ate a whole one? Yeah. Okay. This was for Lila's request. She wanted to get this truck and then put these little pumpkins in the truck. You wanted this. Oh yeah, I know. So I said, that's a very good idea. How could I say no? Do you want to put the pumpkins in? Yeah. Okay, put them in over there. No, I can't open these. Oh, here, I'll help you. No, no, And then you can put it on the table right there by the front door. Okay. We got this cute little wreath. No, that's all so It was yeah, only $10. I thought, put it on the front door. Right. Yeah, honey. And then we got these little steaks. Um, I thought they were so cute. And we can put them in the front yard or in our hay bale. Um, got this little pumpkin. I thought we could put this outside. You can hang it or you can also stand it, which I thought was nice. Like I said, we're not really putting anything on the walls because we're going to be painting hopefully within the next month or so. Like we're starting upstairs and we'll hopefully make our way down here soon. So I don't want to put anything on the walls just for it to come down. So that'll probably go outside or we can like stand it, which I like. And then we got this for outside, which I thought was super cute. Um, They had a Halloween one, but I thought this was good because it'll last us like for October and even um, into Thanksgiving, even though we kind of decorate for Christmas, mm -hmm. like in November outside, I just thought it was good even for next year to put it out like early September. Let me show them. Yeah. Look at Lila just decorated the truck. It's so cute. Good job. Thanks. It looks so good. High five. Ben needs some socks now that he, it's not summer. <laughs> He's not really wearing shoes. Um, I got him some socks. And then I also got him a little, Daisy, I also got him a little pair of shoes. I don't want to spend a ton of money on shoes right now because he'll be walking pretty soon, so I want to wait till he starts walking. But just something to put on his feet for when it starts getting cold out, um, just so his feet aren't super cold. And then we got these cute little plates, paper plates for Halloween. They're so cute. They say blue on them. Um, and then I just got some paint for the kids. But yeah, I went in there for cleaning stuff, stuff and I didn't even get any of that. I was so distracted by the Halloween stuff. And I think it's because we just started decorating our porch yesterday that I wanted to get more things. But, but how cute. Gotta take off the tag, obviously. But and here's our little... Hey, Bail. Probably gonna move some things around, but I think it's cute. I have more pumpkins. I think the truck needs to go inside, but Lila insisted on putting it out here. Right now I'm standing in the corner I see you from across the room it's kind of crowded here, but I know you see me too. Everybody's singing, oh, everybody's singing, oh. I don't know what it is about you. It must be in the way you move. Just say you want me to. We've got nothing to lose. You're looking so old. You're looking so old. Baby, let me love you, let me love you Let me love you, let me love you Baby, let me love you, let me love you Let me love, let me love Baby, let me love you Just say the word That's filthy and disgusting Reminders to clean your couch I have not cleaned my couch since the move. So gross, but it's clean now. If I ever buy a new couch again, which I hope I do get a new couch in a couple years, I'll get a washable couch because with kids and our dogs, it's disgusting. Baby, let me love you. Mmm. -hmm.
look in your eyes I don't know how but it feels like I'm drunk on you It's almost like you make me fly And when I look at you smile 